Hello Libra, how's it going? I'm going to do a love reading for you tonight. We're going to use the love oracles. Yep, the lover's oracle. We're going to get some hidden truths from the males and the females energy. What they may be feeling, what they may be thinking. We'll give you some uh, daily affirmation and a universal collection. <clears throat> Notes from the universe on love and connections by Mike Dooley. Okay. So if you would please be so kind and subscribe, hit the notification button, push all so that you can get the notifications because if you only push the notifications, uh, it doesn't always send the notification unless it says all. And um, thank you. I would really appreciate it. To so those of you who have, thank you. Thank you for subscribing. We're getting the messages across and I really appreciate that. So we're going to see what's the tea, what's the tea for Libra, what's the tea for Libra in love matters, matters of the heart, matters of the emotions, matters from the soul for Libra. Let's see, Libra. Let's see. Let's see. Can we get some messages in Love Matters for Libra? What's the T in love for Libra? What's the T in love for Libra? What's the T? What's the T in love for Libra? For Libra. <clears throat> The truth seekers. The Libra. What's the tea? What's the tea? What's the tea? These cards are humongous. What's the tea, Lee? Spirit guides, ancestors, angels. Can we get some enlightenment in love matters? The Libra. Can we get a few more? Okay, Libra. Let's see what they talking. Let's see what's the tea, Libra. These were the last ones. These were the first ones. Okay, Libra. 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 All right, Libra. We start with... It says... Give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Nice. Know that you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires. Yes. Yes, Libra. You deserve it. You deserve the blessings that are coming your way. Criticizing one another will only lead to further unhappiness. Love and accept each other as you are, and your relationship will magically transform. Yep. 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 Criticizing comes from the mind. You got to go in your heart. Love from your heart. Ooh, secret admirer. Some of you have a secret admirer. Mm -mm -mm. Secret admirer. <laughs> Someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on, Libra. Libra, secret admirer. Mm. And then you have, for some of you, transformation. Your relationship with one another is about to deepen. 
Love conquers and transforms all things. Outstanding. Like I was saying, go from your heart. Love is from the heart. It's not from the mind. The mind is for business things, for knowledge, for under, you know, for other things. Understanding. Look inside yourself. Examine what is causing you to feel this way. It starts with you. It always starts with you. Anything that you want in your life to be, to change, to to if you want to create something um, in love, in, in, in finance, in anything that you want to do in your life. Anything that you want to do in your life starts with you. Because it's your life. It's your life. And therefore, nothing can, nobody else can create what you want for your life. Like... Even if you tell them what you want and they give you what you want, you still were the one who put it into motion because you communicated that. Okay? So whatever you want in your life is up to you. It's up to you. Your life is up to you. Which way it go, the choices you make, the actions you make, your free will, destiny, all of it. All of it. Emotions are a natural and necessary part of life. But they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. Yep. Forgive yourself and others. <clears throat> For some of you, we have power. Well, it's the first time I see this card. Power. You instinctively know what is right for you and you have the power to say no or to walk away at any time. Because your life is your life and whatever you deal with in your life, whatever you do in your life, whatever it is going on in your life is your responsibility because your life is your life. Wait. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. So for some of you, allow nature to take its course. Let time do what it do. But remember, the time keeps ticking. And it waits for no one. Manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. Go with your heart. This is a love reading. Love got to do with the heart. If you go from your mind, you can destroy a beautiful, beautiful thing. Yep. Yes, you can. And so we're going with feminine energy. Feminine energy. What's the tea? What's the tea for the Libras? Spirit guides, ancestors, angels, can we please get some information for the Libras? Is the tea sizzling? Huh? Or is, <laughs> or is it cold? How's the feminine feeling today? What she may be thinking, what she may be feeling. The tea for the feminine. The T for the feminine, for Libra. Remember to take what's for you. What's not for you, we leave for Cinderella. You can't, you know, don't try to apply pressure, trying to make things fit. Because you're just going to make things difficult for yourself. Okay? What's for you is for you. You know what's for you because only you know your life. I'm just here to give a message, some enlightenment, you know. Help you to decide what you want to do with your life, you know. And that's what that is. Please subscribe, like, comment, say hi, I'll say hi. Share, you know. We can get the message around. We can get it to who it needs to be. We get it to Cinderella, Cinderella, you know. And we do what it do. Alright, we got a conversation. Let me see. 
Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Well, these came out first. So let's start here. Let's put this back over here. Because this came out first. And so this, this over here. All right. All right. Ooh. All right. All right. Yep. We do got a conversation over here. Okay, Libra. <clears throat> Okay, for some of you, it says, I feel you leaving me behind. It can be you. It could be your energy. It can be your mate's energy. You know? If it fits on the left foot, you put it on the left foot. And if it fits on the right foot, you put it on the right foot. And everything goes smoothly. Okay? Okay. I feel you leaving me behind. I am afraid to contact you. I love you unconditionally. Unconditionally is deep. Because it's not easy. But nothing easy. Nothing good is easy. It just ain't. Right? But as you grow and as you learn, hopefully you learn from your mistakes. Right? Um, it becomes easier for the people that learn their lessons. Right? And then it says... You and I were too young. I regret lying to you. I love you. Yep. So, um, somebody's in regret. For some of you, you were too young. But there's love. There's, I love you unconditionally, and I love you. And then it says, I wish I had treated you better. It was my fault, but I blamed you. I'm so attracted to you. It's time for me to heal now. You were the best thing in my life. How much are you with? Okay, so that was the feminine energy. Uh the most I get out of the energy is that I love you. I love you twice. I love you unconditionally, and I love you. Yep, let me move this over because I can't see these. It said, look inside yourself. Transformations. Power. Give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Transformation, your relationship with one another is about to deepen. Love conquers all. Power. You instinctively know what is right for you. And you have the power to say no or walk away at any time. At any time. Examine what is causing you to feel this way. We're going to the energy of a masculines. What's the tea? What's the tea? Spirit guides, ancestors, angels. Can we get some good energy from the masculines for Libras? For the energy of the general collective Libras out there? 
We would like to see a message. We don't share the same values. I had to take it out because it flipped over while I was shuffling. So for some of you, you don't share the same values. Maybe y'all come from different cultures, different backgrounds, um, uh, family, you know, family beliefs. Um, the second one is I trusted you. We don't share the same values. I trusted you. So somebody's disappointed in some of you, or you're disappointed. Um, you thought someone shared the same visions as you, or goals, or, or just beliefs. Not. I can be myself with you. I need security. I feel so drawn to you. <clears throat> so I need security and I feel so drawn to you. For someone, for some of you, maybe um, someone feels secure with you. When they're around you, they feel secure, safe. I daydream about a life with you. So yeah, this energy here it makes me feel like um, like somebody feels safe, safe, safe in the security, safe uh, mentally, emotionally, physically, safe around this energy. Whoever whoever the this whoever this resonates with, either you feel safe with your partner, or they feel safe with you, or whoever you're thinking about. Or however that resonates for you. You know if you feel safe with someone. You know. You know if you can lay beside someone. And, and, and feel like nothing and no one can hurt you or harm you. In any way. You know that. And then we have. I know you don't feel the same. But for some of you. There's doubt. Let's see. There's doubt. It says emotions are a natural and necessary part of life, but they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. Do I still have a chance? I still have feelings for you. I know you don't feel the same. Do I still have a chance? I still have feelings for you. And then we have, I do love you. I wish we could go back. I want to start over. I can't get enough of you. I do love you. I wish we could go back. I want to start over. I can't get enough of you. So for some of you, for some of you, you're missing someone or they're missing you and they want a fresh start and the wheel is turning and the new year is coming in and um, yep. <laughs> Yep, yep, yep. So that was your hidden truth with the feminine and the masculine. And then we're going to get some notes from the universe. See what the universe got to say in your love life. They want to send you some messages, some guidance. 
some understanding, some illumination. You know? Let's see what the universe got to say. Universe, you're welcome into the room. With the energies for Libra and their love life. They want to know what's the tea, Lee. They want to know what's the tea. Universe, can we get some messages for Libra in their love life? For Libra, general, collective of Libra. Here we go. Here we go, Libra. Let's see what's the tea with the universe. Let's see what messages they got to send out for you. In your love life. In your love cycles, baby. In your love cycles. You got power. You instinctively know what is right for you. And you have the power to say no or to walk away at any time. Give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Look inside yourself. Examine what is causing you to feel this way. Emotions are natural and necessary part of life. But they can also distort perception and can cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. You got a secret admirer. For some of you got a secret admirer. Look around. It could be anybody. It could be anybody. Bus driver. The, 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 the. <laughs> the donut man uh, I don't know You know where you be and what you do Who you around hmm? Who you around That's paying attention Who you around Libra Somebody paying attention And you have There are really only two types of people Oh wait It says everyone is doing their best There are really only two types of people those you now love and those you will love until there's only one type of person. Until then, we'll probably hit replay. The game of life. The universe. The game of life. Oh. Everyone is doing their best. Hopefully. Hopefully everyone is doing their best. You know, don't hold yourself back. Go your full potential. Put your best foot forward. Always, always, always with good intention. And that's how we get good outcomes. That you have options is meaningful. Rock on. And then it says, If I could make just two wishes, I'd wish I could somehow convey to you the profound depths of my gratitude for every moment of your life. I'd also wish that you could somehow know of your unimaginable importance, just as you are now, to the lives of so very many. And of course, I'd wish for even more wishes. Oh, shoot. <laughs> you are such a good idea. Oh, you are such a good idea, Libra. The universe. They say rock on, baby. They say rock on. They say rock on. It says, time for a love fest. Woo! You got a secret admirer. Mm -hmm. And what was that one? Manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. Ooh, your heart is going to lead you to your soulmate. Mm. Time for a love fest. Actually, everyone is reasonable. They just have their own reasons. Cool. Mm. And usually it's worth trying to learn what they are to maximize chances of a full blown 60s style psychedelic love fest. Which is always a good thing. Groovy you. The universe. A psychedelic love fest. 
Y'all birthdays are coming up. Who's gonna make a psychedelic love fest? Groovy. A 60s style love fest. We in Libra season. It says, prepare to be astounded. Prepare to be astounded. Send them love. Wish them peace. See them happy. Everyone, always, forever. Amen. And prepare to be astounded. The universe. P.S. Oh, man. And will you ever become a big time manifester? Mm, 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 mm. Amen. 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 Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ain't that the truth? Yes. Yes, universe. Preach. Tell these people. <laughs> Love in spite of it all. Yes. Yes. Before this odyssey ever began, there was you, your best friends, and wide-eyed curiosity among you about who would be the first to leap. The first to forget, the first to kiss, the first to tell, the first to fall, the first to get back up, and the first to remember that it all began with a dare. <laughs> oh, wow, that really reminded me of my like childhood and teenage years. Cool. To love in spite of it all is that you, Murgatroyd, the universe, is that you, Murgatroyd, the universe? P.S. I remember the glint in your eyes, all three of them. Oh, that was so sweet. I like that. Love in spite of it all. Yes, no matter what you go through in life, don't get bitter. Don't get bitter. Life is good if you decide to do good and be tried. You know, like, we're not perfect. We're not perfect. No one's perfect. But if you try to do things with good intention, you get good results. It says, things are not as they appear. The lower the price of your love, the higher its value. Brain freeze, the universe. Yeah. The more you give the, your love, the more valuable you are. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. 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 So be aware, you know, of your surroundings. And, 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 and know, though. Try to fill it out. Try to feel it. If you go from your heart, your heart will let you know when it's good, when it's not good. You know. There isn't a soul on the planet who doesn't crave your approval. The only difference between a friend and a foe, <laughs> wasn't I just saying, to be, is that you've decided where love can grow. Ho, oh, oh shit. <laughs> the universe. Oh wow. Okay. There isn't a soul on the planet who doesn't crave your approval. And I didn't add that part. It's there. Look. What's in me? What's in me? <laughs> and then you have find the good. Sometimes the good is hidden. Find the good in what they said or asked. It's always there. Even if they didn't mean it for it to be there. Uh, P.S. The universe. P.S. Clues for what you want are hidden all around you. Sometimes the good is hidden. Just don't take too long waiting for it to come out. Because sometimes people take too damn long. <laughs> Turn on your love light. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Sometimes the best way to remain sane is to love like crazy. Works for me. The universe. Okay, Libra. Okay, Libra. Okay, Libra. Okay, Libra. We're going to get you a daily affirmation. And then we're going to run this out. 
And then I'm going to go do what I got to do. And we'll see what happens. Libra, sounded pretty good. Time for love fest. Ooh. Love like crazy. It's the way to remain sane. Love in spite of it all. Yes. Wow, there was love everywhere. The lower the price of your love, the higher its value. Yes, give freely. Your love, knowledge, understanding of people. Give those things freely. Because you never know what people need to hear or things like that. Or who you can help when you give knowledge freely, love freely, you know. Uh, it says, I release physical and emotional tension to create space for flow. My future self can handle it. I will measure today by how fully present I am. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, okay, I'm not going to find it, but I, this... It came up earlier. I must jump first. I know the universe will catch me. Absolutely. Absolutely. Good intention. Always. Always, always. I find strength in silence. And I envision my higher self. And stand showing up as her. I will measure today by how fully present I am. I envision my, my highest self and I will start showing up as her. Yes. Yes, Libra. You do that. You do that, Libra. You do that. Do that. Do that. You know what's for you. You know what wasn't. Please subscribe. Don't be shy. Hit like. If you want to say hi, I'll say hi. You know, let's get the message across for Cinderella, wherever she at. If she need it, whatever was for you. I hope that, you know, you got some clarity on what you needed to know. And that was your tea, Libra. Have a good night.